Imagine a system so efficient that every action you take builds momentum, making the next one easier and more powerful. This is the concept behind the flywheel effect, a cycle where small, consistent improvements lead to big compounding growth and breakthroughs. Today we're going to explore how generative AI isn't just automating tasks, it's enabling this same flywheel effect in business processes. Let's dive into how every task you automate can become fuel for your business's next breakthrough. So the flywheel effect is a concept introduced by Jim Collins in Good to Great. And if you've been in business for a while, you've probably heard of it. Um, but if not, imagine pushing a heavy flywheel. At first, it's difficult to move, but with consistent effort, the flywheel starts to spin faster and faster. Over time, the energy builds up and the flywheel almost moves by itself with minimal additional effort. If you're watching this, you probably already know what generative AI is or you have a good concept of it, but let's define it so it makes sense within the context of the flywheel effect. Generative AI refers to AI systems that can create new content, automate tasks, or solve problems through learning and pattern recognition. But here's why I'm positioning it as a flywheel. Generative AI works on many, many different kinds of tasks. Uh, content creation, design, uh, customer service, data analysis, developing product ideas. It's this versatility that drives the flywheel effect. And this means that there are a lot of areas of opportunity to apply these tools. The more tasks AI automates, and I'm talking about tasks here, I'm not talking about jobs. The more tasks AI automates, the more time you free up and the more innovation and productivity you can push forward. But there's a common misconception. Many companies are using generative AI to reduce their workforce. And I'm here to tell you that's short-term thinking. Maybe that's something worth investigating in the long run, but that's not where the low-hanging fruit is. Generative AI isn't about cutting staff, at least not now. It's about augmenting, accelerating, amplifying, and automating your human abilities. It's about freeing up your team's time so they can focus on high value strategic work. And it creates a virtuous cycle where humans and AI work together, driving long-term growth and success. And here's where the magic happens. Once generative AI automates routine tasks, uh, workers suddenly have more time to focus on high value strategic work. But instead of stopping there, this freed up time can be reinvested into more AI development, more generative AI use case identification, automating even more tasks. This creates that flywheel effect where every gain in efficiency builds on the last compounding over time. It's a cycle of automation and innovation. Take customer service automation as an example. At first, AI may handle basic inquiries, but with more time and focus, you can train the AI to handle complex queries, making your processes even more efficient. And guess who the best experts are to help make those changes? It's the people who do those processes. Free them up and enable them to help drive the innovation you need. So this approach has good crossover with the Six Sigma and Lean methodologies and other process improvement schools of thought from the past, which focus on continuous improvement and eliminating waste. Just as Lean encourages teams to streamline processes and add value at every step, Generative AI allows businesses to reduce waste of manual effort by automating non-value added tasks. In both cases, it's about creating a culture of efficiency and optimization where each improvement builds momentum for the next. Generative AI is like high octane fuel for continuous improvement programs. Imagine a workplace where generative AI handles most routine tasks, allowing humans to focus on creativity, strategy, and innovation. I said some terms there, creativity, uh, creativity strategy, innovation. Th these are part of the capabilities talked about the generative AI hype. So what? Uh, calculators didn't do away with mathematicians. Gen AI won't do away with people in these disciplines, at least not for now. The near future is a world where businesses operate with maximum efficiency and every hour saved by automation is reinvested into further improvements. Like the old 
uh, concept behind the Lean methodology. So the good news is that these tools are highly accessible, and this isn't just for mega corporations with many billions to spend on transformation and huge tech development part departments. This approach creates that flywheel effect that frees up the time in your operation and will enable your company to scale faster and innovate at unprecedented pace, no matter the size. This is why I focus on small to medium sized businesses. And if you want to take your business processes to the next level with generative AI, reach out to me directly. With over 20 years of experience in process improvement, data science, and AI, I can help you build that flywheel effect. Let's unlock your next breakthrough together. And if this kind of content excites you, like taking uh, generative AI and actually thinking about how to integrate it into businesses rather than just talking about the hype, subscribe to the channel, click like, leave a comment below. How do you see generative AI transforming your business?